Hello, everyone, and welcome back. My name is William Alexander, but you can call me Will. I'm a Platinum 2000 leader for our organization, and I'm super excited to show you how to use Coinbase as a Bitcoin wallet in order to send and receive Bitcoin to your broker and back to yourself when you're ready to withdraw your profits. So let's hop right on to it. I'm going to share my screen, and I'm going to walk you through exactly what Coinbase is, why we use Coinbase, and how you can use this to not only send money to your friends, but also to your broker. So as a recap, what is a broker? A broker is an actual bank that you all will use to actually trade in the market, right? They're gonna give you access to certain assets that you will be able to trade. Those assets include cryptocurrencies, Forex currencies, um, commodities, metals, energies, things of that nature. You as an options trader have access to all of these through our different brokers. What is Bitcoin? Bitcoin is essentially just digital currency, right? We're sending and receiving money um, to one another digitally. And what is a wallet? A wallet is like a checkings account, but for Bitcoin. So the Bitcoin wallet is a checkings account for Bitcoin. So that way you can send and receive Bitcoin <clears throat> appropriately. So we're gonna hop right on over. I actually have my cell phone with me and I'm gonna share my screen. You all will be able to see my screen in three, two, one. All right, now that you all can see my actual phone screen, we're gonna come on over to the Coinbase app. Your enroller should have sent you a link for Coinbase. And at this link, you're going to actually receive $10 of free Bitcoin um, with your enrollment, okay? Now, as you can see, the default screen for Coinbase will always come up here right? You will see that Coinbase offers a variety of cryptocurrencies that you all can buy and sell. You can also do long-term investments here. However, where our main interest lies is here in Bitcoin, okay? We will use Bitcoin to actually send our money from our checking accounts or our debit cards to our actual broker accounts, which are international brokerage firms, okay? So the first thing you wanna do is head on over to settings, right down here in this bottom right corner. And as you can see here, I have two linked accounts. I have my actual checking account information, which is represented by the photo of this bank. Then I actually have the same debit card that is attached to this checking account on file. It is very important that if you want to do instant transactions that you have a debit card on file. The more linked accounts that you have on file, the more money that you actually can spend on your Coinbase account. So be sure to connect your two accounts. And um, if you have issues, please contact your enroller and they will assist you with those. The next thing you're gonna do is come over to limits and features. This is going to allow you to know exactly how much money you can spend and um, purchase cryptocurrencies, as well as if you are able to actually send or receive cryptocurrencies. This is very important. You have to enable send and receive in order to actually be able to send this money to your offshore international brokerage firm. In addition to that, you must be sure that your card purchases, as well as wire transfers, have been completely enabled as well. As I said before, the more linked payments that you have, the better. Now, if you're a new user, unlike myself, you'll usually have the feature up here where it'll say, enable, send, and receive. You will click on that option, and you're gonna follow the prompt, okay? You're gonna take a well-lit photo or selfie of yourself, as well as a photo um, of your ID or your license, right? And you're gonna make sure that that photo is well-lit, that is placed on a black plain surface. So that way that your ID or license is clearly visible. And in your selfie, you're gonna make sure that you are taking, uh, the light is facing towards you. Um, so that way that you can be approved. Account verification can take up to about 24 hours for Coinbase, but usually in most cases, I've only witnessed it only take 10 to 15 minutes max. If you have issues, um, which there are some folks who might experience some issues with verification, please contact your enroller for some additional support. Now, after you've completed 
enabling your send and receive, adding your two payment methods or more, you'll be then for a bumped to a level three verification. It is important that you are exactly at level three verification. You've completed um, by verifying your phone number, verifying your personal information, as well as verifying your photo ID. So that way you get the maximum capacity. My favorite thing about Coinbase is as I use this for withdrawals, because as you can see, bank deposits can actually take up to $25,000 per day. You can also do transactions for up to $250,000 per day on wire transfers and $25,000 per day through PayPal. This is very important because when you all are six, seven, and eight figure earners in this market, you will need to be able to withdraw large amounts of money and Coinbase is the right place for you to do it. So after you have now been verified, you will come to your settings screen and actually see these level three limits and features, as well as your linked accounts. You'll be ready to purchase cryptocurrencies at that moment. 